Look at what Laura Nativo taught Ripper to do. Ripper, Ripper get me a soda. Oh, he's trying. He's gonna get it. He'll get it. He'll get it. <laughs> Good boy, Ripper. Bring it here. <laughs> <gasps> Ripper said, Kim. Yay! Yay! Good boy, Ripper. Little bear. Good boy. Everybody, high five. <laughs> high five. Look at that. High five. That Where's is my a, high five? Oh. Yeah. There's a high. Way That's to go, Ripper. Boy. Oh. Okay. Oh. One take. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna do slippers and the remote control. That's what's next. Perfect. Now I can train Mark to do that. <laughs> All right. How do you, how did you start? How do you begin teaching your animal a trick like that or a behavior like that? Okay, so this is a very advanced trick, but it's something that anybody can do at home with their dog. We're basically going to use a technique of back chaining, which is where we string together a whole bunch of fairly simple behaviors. Here we go. Good boy, are you ready? So the first thing that we're gonna do, we want to basically start from the end and then work away to the beginning. So okay. the, the hardest part is teaching your dog to actually fetch the soda. And I'm using a plastic bottle because I don't like metal. Um, they can puncture it, they can hurt themselves. Okay. So we wanna desensitize. Yes, good boy. So I would click. Now Ripper knows this, but if you have a dog that might not wanna take it with their mouth, you would do something called shaping. And you would just click and treat for simply touching the bottle with mm -hmm. their mouth. But with Ripper, Ripper, take it, hold, give, 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 <laughs> drop it. <laughs> <laughs> we practice this so much, it's like I'm not letting it's it go. Give, yes, it good boy, right. Ripper. All good right, so boy. You have to, how do you get a dog to open a fridge and get inside? Can All you right. take us over there, So Charles? the next step, yeah, let's, let's go, go over go. to the fridge. Good boy, Ripper, come on. Come I here, have buddy. got to teach Fred how to do this, and then he's going to oh. fold laundry, and this he's going to do dishes. Absolutely perfect. You can teach your dog to fetch the newspaper, to fetch really anything using these techniques. Look, <laughs> <laughs> all right, Rick, Ripper, Fair, Ripper, fetch. Anybody? Good boy here. Give. Yes, good boy. So the next step, once your dog knows how to fetch and bring it back uh -huh. to you, then we want to teach them how to open and close the fridge. So. If your dog knows how to tug or likes to play with they a toy. All, they all know how to tug. They all do. Yeah, they want to do that. All we're going to do is rename tug to open it. So you can take your treats and you have your clicker. Ripper, open it. So he doesn't, he's like, oh, I don't know. What does that mean? So if I take it and I play with it, Ripper, fetch, fetch, tug, get it. <laughs> so maybe come from this side, get it. And he's showing exactly what dogs at home might do. They get, they get confused. Hey, tug, yeah. tug. Tug, Ripper, tug, Ripper, tug, tug. You got it, you got it. Tug, tug, tug. There yes, go. good boy. Open it. So even for a dog like Ripper, you know, sometimes it takes a couple practices. Good boy. And I'm gonna click the instant that he gets it. So he starts to learn, you're marking his behavior. He uh -huh. knows exactly when he's doing the right thing. And then the final step is teaching him how to close it. So I could use food as a lure. And I'm gonna stand here and position him for success. So ready, close it. Oh. Yes, good boy. How did, okay, so then how do you get, he's, he's inside, and you just, he sees the bottle that you taught him before? So yeah, so now we're gonna, we're gonna basically teach this in many steps, and this is something with patience, consistency, a lot of love, <laughs> good boy. So if, if Ripper didn't already know it, I might just hold the bottle here, fetch, bring it. Sure. Give. Would you want to remove other bottles and things when you're first starting, the ketchup bottle and mustard or whatever, and take that out of there? Absolutely. Now, when you're teaching something like this, you want to make it really simple, set your dog up for success. So remove any of the other food that's in the fridge. Now, we've got two bottles. Wow. Can I have one? <laughs> Our hero <laughs> bottles. Ripper, can Good I have one? Boy. <laughs> He's trying to Thank open you, it. Ripper. He wants to open it. He wants to open it. That's He'll the next over, trick. Over water, <laughs> or over, over ice. Good what? boy. Oh, right. Can you, good, can good you think boy. if you went over, you, you don't have to go way over. Can you see if he'll do it again? Do it again? Us? Absolutely. Yeah. Let's see. You guys want to see it again? Okay. You guys Everybody ready? Still, so, yeah. I want to so, distract him. Okay. Here okay. he goes. Let's see if he'll ready? Do it again. Ripper, fetch me a soda. Oh. Oh. Good boy, Ripper. What a good boy. That's fantastic. Mark, oh, I'm going to have Fred do that. <laughs> I've, I've got to teach Freddie this. More information on, on Laura Nativo on our website, hallmarkchannel.com, and you can see some tips that she has. <laughs>